Hello everybody and welcome to our video tutorial on OpenCart 3 and today in this tutorial I will show you how to create a new theme for OpenCart uh, website um, so um, as you can see if you go to system and settings uh, and if you edit your store and if you scroll on general tab all the way down um, you can see under the theme selector you can uh, have only we have only one option so I will show you how to make it another another theme uh, folder option so n first thing we're gonna do it's uh, to go to our um, open cart um, main folder main di directory and um, uh, gonna go we're gonna first we're gonna go to catalog uh, folder and then go to the view folder and theme and as you can see here we have uh, one folder it's called default that is represent our default theme so what we're gonna do we're gonna copy this um, folder and we're gonna um, name this folder uh, according to our name of our theme so I'm gonna call my uh, 22 web theme so um, so we here as you can see we have uh, all the folders for our theme image style sheet and image and template folder so next step um, we're gonna go to uh, folder admin folder and we're gonna first we're gonna create language file for our theme so if you go to language uh, yeah English uh, your language folder and then go to extension and theme and as you can see here we have again one file that uh, language file for default uh, theme so now we're gonna copy again this file and we're gonna name it the same name that we named before our, our folder uh, so 22 web theme in my in our case so let's open this file as you can see um, it has all the all the language um, uh, text so we're gonna we're gonna change heading tile title of our uh, theme so we're gonna call it 22 web uh, um, so everything else we're gonna leave as it is um, save it so next step let's go back again to our um, folder uh, open card folder and then next time next step we're gonna go to view in ad under admin folder view and then temp template and extension and then choose theme and as you can see here we have default tweak template for our uh, default theme so what we're gonna do again we're gonna copy and we're gonna rename it according our new theme name so let's open it and um, as you can see uh, we have some names and uh, uh, that we need to change um, so so what we're gonna do we're gonna um, 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 replace um, seam default um 
we're gonna replace with our seam and underscore and then name of our um, new seam uh, seam replace all so now as you can see we have um, replaced every every one of them uh, so let's check again oh, yes we don't have it okay um, let's save it so uh, next last step uh, in creating of this uh, folders we're gonna go under um, controller we have we need to create controller uh, for uh, theme um, in admin uh, in front end so we're gonna go theme and again on the controller extension theme and then as you can see here's another file that we're gonna copy and rename it um, so after renaming we're gonna open it and as you can see here we have to change again web theme language and um, let's see if we have gonna do seam under for default and we're gonna replace it with the seam underscore and name of our new seam so let's replace all of them yes okay it's replaced um it was one, 192 occurrences, so looks like we're good. Uh, let's check again. Fold, make sure we didn't miss anything. Um, uh -huh, here we have extension seem default. gonna replace with our again with our new sim and also we need to change class of this controller so replace again okay so not found. Let's close it, save it. What I forget to do, to do is um, to change one of the templates files. Um, we have to change a uh, reference uh, to CSS file. So I will show you what I mean. Uh, let's go back to our folder, uh, to our um, file system, open cart file system, and under um, under catalog go back to view and seam and under our newly created uh, seam folder um, uh, that we created from default let's go to template folder and under common folder is you can see there's a lot of uh, few tweaks tweak files uh, it's templates file so uh, we need a header that tweak file as you can see here uh, on the line 25 we have reference to our uh, style sheet but it's uh, from the default uh, theme since we copy it from default so uh, we have to we have to change uh, this to our uh, new uh, folder name, sim folder name. So uh, it's 22 web sim. So let's save it. So 
So now we're gonna go to our admin panel for uh, open card and over here we're gonna open extension menu let's open it a new tab and under the extension type we're gonna choose the themes and as you can see now we have uh, two themes um, available and one of them it's our new theme so go ahead install it um, and by default after when you install as you can see status is disabled so we need to enable it let's go edit and change status to enabled and as you can see everything looks good so let's save it so now uh, it's enabled uh, let's go back to our uh, open card refresh and let's go on the theme and here we go now we have our new theme available um, in drop down and select um, control uh, and select um, input so now choose if you choose it you have new theme uh, available and let's save it let's go to our uh, front end fresh it um, let's open uh, developer uh, menu developer uh, tools by clicking F12 and as you can see in, uh, under inspector tab uh, if you hover on the style sheet file so uh, you can see its references in our uh, new 22 web theme folder so um, uh, and we're gonna next video I'm gonna show you how how to change uh, appearance of your new theme and we're gonna work with this uh, style sheet file uh, thank you for watching and uh, good good coding coding for open card thank you for watching and see you next time bye